this is me, believe it, this is me chopping and preparing the onions to use as, you know, the pH indicator because that's what you got. You got the onions, you live with the onions. Alright, now that you're good to go and you've minced your onions, you just put them in this beaker and allow it to, you know, to just bring it to a boil, get all of those good onion stuff, you know, the good onion stuff for it to be used as your pH indicator. So you want to boil it just right. Now we're just going to take filter paper and filter this mixture so we can get rid of all of the impurities because we don't want that in there. We just, we just want the solution so we can use it as our pH indicator. I also am going to use some vinegar. I just found this in the kitchen. Over here we have some liquid detergent and any will do. Um, anything you have at home is fine and if you don't, you know, store-bought is fine. It doesn't really matter what kind. Here we have some squeezed lemons, you know, because we're not gonna test the whole lemon. We just want to find out the pH of the juice. These brands I'm using, I will not disclose because, you know, you, might, you guys might think this is just a paid advertisement, which it is not. Now we have our prepared acids and bases, of course, right here on our ceramic plates. And we will add some of this solution just enough, you know, just enough to see the color change. When it turns pink, you have found your acids. Bingo, we have a winner. Alright, just for good measure now, you will get your pH papers and just let them swim in those substances in order to act, you know, to confirm again that, you know, these are acids, these are bases. And there we have it. That is how you use an onion as a pH indicator for your acids and for your bases. So if you like this video, maybe give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and let me know if you want to see more videos like this, and maybe hit subscribe if you want to see more of me and more of my videos. And that's it. I'll see you guys in my next video.